we first moved to Colts Neck in 1968, the property behind our backyard was a corn farm, tended by three little old ladies who watered their crop with a sprinkling can. One by one, over the years, the ladies passed on, and the property lapsed into a small jungle of new growth, brambles, trees, and vines. Today, we have a lush, dense, green space in the backyard and a row of trees that separates our property from the general store, a private enclosure, and a pleasant, quiet place to relax. But recently, the property was purchased, and I had visions of our green space turning into an asphalt parking lot. I checked the property map and decided to fly my Bebop 2 quadcopter over the tree line to see how the new owners might develop their property. Based on the map, I expected to see a slice of green that covered a somewhat triangular shape. And so begins a very interesting, exasperating, and frightening experience. In moments after liftoff, I was above the trees and totally disoriented. There was no defined boundary line, just an expanse of green much larger than the slice of property I expected. I rotated the drone to see if I could determine the boundaries, but my view confused my mind's eye. I did not recognize any familiar landmarks from the air. The drone had been set to the sports function, and a forward push of the joystick quickly moved the quadcopter at a speed of 40 miles an hour. I could see cars on the road below. Was I looking at Route 537? And then I saw a spire on a white building along the road. Was that the Reformed Church? I couldn't be sure. Familiar structures look different from the air. If that was the church, I could certainly find my way back toward the general store. I rotated and flew back in that expected direction, but what I saw was a golf course, and I was closing in fast on those unrecognized towers. They were high-voltage power lines. Stop! I'm lost! How long was the drone in flight? It seemed a long time. How much time before the battery quit? And then, the most frightening part of the flight. The screen started to show horizontal bars, and in a moment, it went blank, with a message that said, I was disconnected. Was I hovering? Was I moving? Which way? Will I lose the drone in a spark of light and cause a power outage in Colt's Neck? Or will the drone just fall into the trees or elsewhere? And then a whirring sound. The drone was overhead. I don't recall if I had pushed the home button or whether the drone automatically returns itself when it senses it only has enough juice to get itself home.
I pulled off the goggles and made a perfect four-point landing. <laughs>